What's going on, everybody? It's Rick and Rice jumping back into Inner World. Now, I have taken a couple of days off. It has been a crazy, just, yeah, it's been one of them weeks. So, I took a couple of days off after playing the last episode of um, Little Nightmares. Yeah, I had to find out in my mind. But here we're back into. And, all right. Okay, you're you're just you're helpless. The tank is full of honey. Ooh. Dippy dippy. Mmm. Yummy. Oh, so you drank it. That's nice. The machine is aiming at that strange animal on the edge of the forest. A red button connected to the machine. I have the urge to press it and see what will happen. As do I. What kind of characters are you then? What are you doing here? Oh, look, gentlemen. We have a visitor. Great! Are you, by chance, the cleaning lady we called? Cleaning lady? You can start right there in the back. It's been years since it's last been swept. May I ask what you're doing here? Aerological research. What does that mean? You don't know? No, I don't. Vams, don't be so hard on her. She's just the cleaning lady. I can't believe it. She's never heard of aerology. What exactly are aerologists? Okay. Is that some kind of religion? Religion? <laughs> Aerology is the science of the wind. It's a difficult field. Yes, sir. Religion is for weak spirits and holidays. We explore the gods' paths with gauges. Are you talking about that box back there? Box? Tola, did you just call it a box? Oh, yes. I think I heard it, too. So, please, box? This complicated apparatus sends out analog impulse vehicles, which we use to precisely analyze the wind. Ah. And then we draw these winds onto the map. The Erica Charter. I see. Do you know the crazy old guy in the treehouse? Oh, that guy. You have to watch out. That guy is dangerous. Yes, we've tried to pass him, but he always sends a scattering. We had to leave our fourth buddy behind. <gasps> oh, Simon. But the old guy is almost deaf, nearly blind, and probably a thousand years old. And you're three people. Are you implying that we should have used violence? <laughs> I mean, we've tried. But he's vastly superior in strength. Yes, that's not just an old guy. He's a trained killer without any conscience. We lost Simon because of him. Okay. Simon was such a good guy. But we expect him to return any day now. Nope. Well then, good luck. So, you're missing a friend? Yes. Is. His name is Simon. I refuse to. Well, he didn't return from his expedition. Not yet. All that we have left of him. Will be left. Whatever. He was a genius and a gentleman. He invented this globe here, for example. Can I have it? You'd have to rip it out of my cold, dead hands. Interesting suggestion. We actually don't need it anymore. But Lats drinks his root coladas out of it. Yes, it's possible to stick straws into the wind fountain holes. Also, Simon probably wants it back when he comes home. So, no. You're a sophisticated... It ran out of fuel. Besides, our friend poured honey into the tank. And I would do it again. <laughs> 
We know I that. I do it too. Just go back to sleep. So you exactly. We hardly dare to a wind fountain. Where there's another wind fountain. That would be unbelievable. If the map is completed, you could determine where it is. Of course. We're si honey. Okay. I have to go. Could you maybe? Oh, maybe. I. Those wimps. The last time I was camping, I slept in a ditch, and it was raining. Oh. She's one of those kind of women. Oh, it's been a while since I played. No, it's... Oh, ah, you're lazy, you're useless. Alright, so let's... Th yeah, yeah, I hear you screaming ass. Should I pour into it now? Oh, that's pudding. What? No. Jam. Oh man. Where? Where do I? Do I have gas somewhere? Wait, what is in my inventory? Look, I didn't even check my damn inventory. That's some bullshit. Uh, okay, what do I got? Small box. No more chili drops. Aww. No more chili jobs. It's a mix of me angry. It's not usable anymore. Oh no shit. No, don't want the view. Mm. I'm supposed to great the answer. The Gorf said a pair of glasses sank here. I wonder what else is hidden in the depths of the swamp. Yes, I, I can feel the glasses just like, but I can't pull them out. Yeah. You're a spicy little one, aren't you? Nope. Yeah, let's go back this direction and see if there's anything else we can take from these nerdy guys. Hmm. I need the gasoline there. Shush, little screaming guy. Slowly, but surely, you're getting desperate, huh? I'm gonna stab you in the throat. Yeah. Well then, good. what the hell's screaming in there? I want to see it. Give it to me. That's what Asposia looks like from the outside? But what outside would that be? And who could have ever seen the world from out there? Maybe a mole that is able to look through the earth. It's only a globe, okay? An abstract reproduction. I would have to climb over that snoring guy. Hmm. Exactly what I thought. Nothing. Now it's aiming at the crazy old man in the treehouse. Yeah, but what can we put in there? I'm trying to think. Where is it? Do we have any fuel anywhere? Do we know where there's any fuel? I'm curious as hell. Oh, this game makes you think, makes you feel like shit, makes you feel like you don't know what the hell's going on. No fooling around. I have to save the world. I, I don't want to fool around. I want gasoline. Do you 
still need that. Maybe. And I let it be. No. Oh. Okay. What good would that? Uh, Should I stir it? Yes, yes, stir it. Stir it, you crazy, crazy little lady. Alright. Let's go back up top and see if there's something up there that I'm missing. She's a ninja. I like it. Alright, let's look. Okay, that's their buddy. He did. Can we take the era? It's stuck. Ha, it's stuck a Rooney. Um. Uh, nope, that won't work. Well, you're about as worthless as anybody can be. Seriously. Well, I don't see no gas up top. In order to get up there, I'd need help. Hmm. The confusion that sticks in. <laughs> there has to be something with these nerdy dudes. There has to be something I'm missing. I mean, I turned it to where it's facing him so we can shoot it at him. Hmm. What else? What else? What else? What else could we possibly do? That little thing's gonna piss me the fuck off. A saddle on a barrel. Should we tell him that he's dead? Hey, since you have nothing else to do, can I? Okay. How does your machine work? It's very well. The machine strategically sends out small paper impulse vehicles. It's able to engineer this itself. So it spits out paper planes. Correct. My goodness, have you ever thought of switching professions? And with these paper planes, you can determine wind current. Exactly. But unfortunately, we hadn't yet discovered any flow paths before the machine broke down. You mean before the sleeping guy poured honey in the tank? Correct again! What kind of fuel does the machine take? It works off a semi-solid combination of coarse-grained materials. So, mud. Well, you mix swamp water and sand. And you get mud. But the correct mix ratio is difficult to obtain. 50-50? Damn. <laughs> Alright, so... I have to go. Oh, before I forget, if you make the beds, could you... Oh, yeah. Maybe. I love... I need to... I need that. I need this. I need that. Is that here? I would have to. Cl okay, so we need swamp liquid and sand. Now, how to obtain dust, small swamp liquid and and or sand? Um. No, no, I didn't. I hit the wrong damn button. Shut your mo your threat. Uh, your throat trap thing. Not a good idea. Um, yeah, we need it. Just saying, we need it. Wow, then I'd ha I could make a tiny puddle or drown something small in it. No, seriously, what should I do with it? Okay, so where do we get sand? Not a good idea. Oh, how do you get the sand? Okay, she makes me angry. So we, I'm thinking we need that apparatus to make the fuel so we can shoot a paper plane at that old guy's eyeball. If I can't see it, it has to be really small. Seriously. 
Not a good idea. Why is it not a good idea? The crazy old guy kidnapped my companion. If we go together, we could maybe save him and your friend. Sounds great. But, uh, I can't leave the station alone. Uh, and I have to uh, do the laundry today. Tumble mice are underestimated. Oh. Great. I'm stuck in a forest with idiots. The crazy old... If we... So... Great. So... Nothing new. Oh, damn it. Hit the wrong button again. Right, come on, come on, come on. Can I have it? You interest. How long have you been working on that map? How long? One year, two years, ten years. Since last Tuesday. Oh, I don't know. I'm able to pinpoint wins exactly, but I never know what time it is. Wonderful. Have you ever thought about, well, filling it up with new mud? Do you think we're crazy? Um, no? No. The only swamp is guarded by a gorf. And we'd also have to pass the crazy wind muck. I've been walking around here for quite a while. And nothing has happened to you yet? No. I've happened to others. So, you just have to mix sand with swamp water to get it going again. It sounds so simple. Yes. As if we just sit around uselessly. We could pour honey in it. So, you just... It's... We... Mm. I have to go. Oh. I... Come on. Pudding, pudding, jam. Oh man. Well, that was a situation in which. No fooling around. I have to say. Okay, so then how are we supposed to fill the container? I need something into which fill the container. And I have nothing in which to fill. Apparently, I can't use that little thing to to put sand and mud into it. Hmm. I have to ask you another question. Hey, I... Are you sure the glasses... That's not food in those arrows. The old man dropped his glasses and started shooting out of anger. Are you sure the glass... Yep. The lunatic? That's not surprising. Are you talking to me? No, you can't... How do you know where all the objects have sunken? Well, there's not much going on here. If something falls into the swamp... So, you just sit here and look around all day? Well, the way you put it, it doesn't sound... Why not? Like ...very inspiring activity. I got nothing else better to do, right? I just meant that it sounds really boring. Uh, I know. What's so dangerous? I, we Which means... I've Did you... Yeah. He's not... I'm not... Yeah, I am. A dry spot? Yes, I have very sensitive skin. It's itching like crazy and I can't scratch myself. But I've already told your husband this. Stop saying that. I've only known him for half an hour. Oh, don't you think Marion was a little hasty then? For the last time, he's not my husband. And if you say that one more time, that itchy spot on your head will be the least of your problems. Um, no reason to fly off the handle, young lady. I'm somewhat irritable because my head is itchy. Well, you rational amphibian, why don't you put something on it? What do you suggest? I don't know. Lotion? Lotion, please! I only use homeopathic remedies. Come on, you just made that word up. 
Mm. Yeah, but overall, it's a good idea. For such a primitive being, you don't seem to be that stupid. Watch it. Would you be in a better mood if that spot wasn't scared? I think so. Would you mind? I'd rather stick my hand in boiling water. <laughs> Funny you say that. The effect would be about the same. Why don't you... I can't! He's not my husband. My claws sink into nearly every hard surface and then I can barely move. But perhaps you could. Possibly find a person selling makeup in this forest? Why don't you get some oil? He's possible. How do you know where? What? So, what do I? I just. Uh, the lunatic is. That's. No. The lunatic. No. Are you sure? Okay, so he's not giving. Enough. Oh, don't think. Wow. She does not help me none. Hmm. I don't know. I really don't know. It's driving me insane. As you hear things in the back, it's probably my wife cleaning or doing something insane. Curiosity is kicking my ass. Can't go in the tent. There's nothing on the maps. I want the globe. Do you need a saddle for? You don't even have a barrel. I don't like you either. So that's what a suppose but maybe it's only not a good idea. Not a good idea. <laughs> getting confused, getting angry, want the damn thingy. Nice idea, but slowly, but Well can you grab the damn thing at least? What should I pour in Pudding What? Jam Oh man I need a device in which to grab. Now it's aiming somewhere into the forest. Now it's aiming at the crazy old man in the treehouse. Okay, that's good. That's what we want. No, it smells weird in there. I'm not going in. Okay, so... I could just start stomping all over the ground. If it doesn't stop screaming, that's what I'll do. Oh, so we found out, okay, we can get the plane, we can shoot a plane at the old guy. We need mud to fill into the device to make it work. And we're stuck on finding something to actually use to fill the device. So we got all that done. We're looking at how to fill the tank, how to get it to shoot the old guy, and figure a way to get his glasses. Oh, and to itch the groove. So when we come back to the next episode, we will be figuring all all that. But as always, this is Rigorous saying, live life, one grain at a time. Peace.